Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are back in Stormworks yet again, and today we are back with our steam locomotive. As you guys can see right here, it is now red, it is no longer green. Um, I haven't actually turned on infinite electricity, so the uh, that wasn't actually pointing forwards, and that wasn't in the air. Uh, but honestly, it actually looks really, really cool. I think we've done a good job so far. What we're going to do today is actually change these wheels on the front to uh, different ones. We're also going to do the same on the back. I might actually get rid of one of them at the back as well, and just have it be a, what is it, an 8? No, a 4? A 4, 8... Two. A 482. Uh, I think that makes sense to do anyway. So we'll probably end up with one wheel on the back. Or two wheels, I suppose. Um, and then two on the front. Or four. That's fine. Okay, we might also then actually start on a tender as well. We'll have to wait and see. Okay, so we're going to go straight in here with uh, trying to figure out what wheels to actually put here instead. Because uh, we could put anything here. <laughs> we could put anything here. Anyway, uh, train? If I type in train, do we actually get a set of wheels that we can use? I think we do! So we could actually use uh, ones like this. Uh, I feel like they would actually fit quite nicely. Uh, but they seem a little bit small. They seem a little bit small. What about these guys? Are these guys too modern? I think they're a little bit too modern. Maybe. Maybe though. Um, and then, I don't know. I feel like we do actually go with these. So they seem a little bit small. Are these bigger? Or are they the same size? I think they're the same size. What about these ones? <laughs> I don't know the difference between any of these guys. What is this one? Alright, so the edges look different on all of these. That's fine. Okay, so if we grab this and we extend it all the way across to the other side, I guess. Like this. There you go. Um, we can do a similar thing right here as well. There we go. And then we can put our wheels on there. Now, unfortunately, I don't think we can actually fit them. <laughs> I don't think we can actually fit them. That's really frustrating. Anyway, uh, if we deleted, let's say here, and we deleted, let's say here. There we go. We'll put ourselves something in like this, and also this. And then we should be able to fit the wheels directly onto whatever we've just put in. So this guy. Turn it around. Okay, we're going to have to delete these two as well. There we go. And delete these two as well, and there we go. Alright, what does that even look like? I think that'll look very strange. <laughs> yeah, that looks awful. What have I done? Alright, get rid of those. They look they look really, really bad. Um, I think... Alright, type in train again. One second. I think we might be able to get something a little bit better, a little bit nicer, a little bit different uh, instead. So delete all of these guys. There we go. Uh, let's try and figure out what else we can actually use. I feel like these. Honestly, they're big enough to actually work for us. And I think they do actually somewhat work better than what we had. But do they? Do they actually? I don't know. Okay, I've actually gone ahead and changed that to two separate ones. And maybe that looks a little bit better. I, I think what we had in the, Like, they look, they look better than these do, right? Or is it just me? Is it just me? I don't know. I feel, I feel like they definitely look better than these guys. Uh, let me know in the comments down below. Anyway, what we'll do now is we'll actually go ahead and start working on the tender. Because we should. Okay, so we got to figure out how high this is, I guess. So what we'll do is we'll bring this guy backwards from here, if we can. Is that possible? Are we allowed to do that? There we go. Uh, we'll go ahead and attach one of these guys to there like this. And then what we'll do is we'll grab one of these and send this up until the point where it reaches this. Okay, so delete all of these guys. There we go. We don't need those. Go ahead and grab this uh, from there all the way down to here. Cut them. And start a new one. Yeah. I don't know how big to make this, but it's going to be quite large, uh, considering. <laughs> Alright, so there we go. We're going to head and put it down. That is fine. Let's go ahead and figure out what we actually want to do here. So delete those guys all the way down to there-ish. There we go. Delete those guys on the bottom. And then if we are going to be using uh, these, let's say. If we are going to be using these as the wheelbase for it. Then we should probably use these as the wheelbase for it. Uh, so, four? Should we do four or should we do five? I think maybe even maybe even two sets. Ooh, I don't know. I think I'm going to go with four. That's fine. Okay, so from there, let's go ahead and bring this guy back down to here. That's okay. We're going to go ahead and go from there, around the front, and around this side. Here we go. Excellent. Uh, and then we're going to probably actually block off the whole top end of this. I know it looks a little bit strange, but that's probably what we're going to do. Uh, we're then also going to go ahead and block off the bottom end of this. So go to the center, 
Go all the way up the side like so. And all of these guys too. Okay. Delete all of this. Whoop. There we go. And that's fine. Yeah. All right. So this is going to be boxed off like a little bit bigger. So we're going to go one, two, maybe even three. A little bit bigger like this. There we go. We're then going to box this off just like so. And that's fine. We're then going to go to the rear. Do exactly the same thing. And hopefully that'll be fine too. And there we go. All right. Cool. I, I think I'm okay with this. Uh, I do. I feel like I am all right with this. Uh, so the next thing I want to do is actually attach these guys into there. Okay. Good. We're going to do the same thing right here. So do this. And spawn it in. Let's see what that actually looks like. A little bit weird. Uh, I feel like the wheels actually need to be bigger, but sure. What we might do is actually put a hole in the middle, bring it forwards a little bit, and take it backwards a little bit, and that'll be fine. Okay, so if we're going to do that idea, let's go ahead and grab this guy and this guy. Cut it, move it forwards one, and paste it there. Good. We're going to go backwards, and we're going to do the same thing. So cut this, move it backwards, uh, maybe even twice. Yeah, okay, we're going to have two sets of wheels, uh, which might be a little bit weird, but I think it works. There we go. Okay, good. Um, I think I'm happy with that. I think I am definitely happy with this. So put that there, go ahead and put that there, seal these guys together, and seal it all the way across. Yes, just like so. Okay, spawn that in. Does that look a little bit better? Whoops. <laughs> Whoops, it fell off the side. No. Okay, attach that to there. Attach that to there. Go. Let's see what this looks like. Yeah, I think we can build a nice tender on top of this. And I think that would look good. Okie dokie. So, let's continue, shall we? We're going to go ahead and design something else. Uh, we're going to get door. If we get a door, uh, we can grab these guys and probably delete them from there all the way to the back. Uh, essentially, what we got this for is to do this little ledge. Because uh, I think that's really cool. So, there you go. We're then going to go ahead and switch to our frantic red and build up the rest of it. So, uh, the side is going to look like this. Uh, obviously, we can go really high with this because that's how high the train is. Um, but essentially, we need to be able to store stuff in here too. So, we're actually going to go ahead and seal this off if we can. Just like so. Go ahead and bring this guy all the way up as well. Okay, so, so far we've built a box. <laughs> so far we have built a box. Uh, I don't know how I feel about that. Meh, it might be okay. So, uh, right, delete these at the front, uh, just like so. We're going to go ahead and bring this backwards, maybe two. Then we're going to go down, so that's about four. Then it's two, then it's one. Okay, so if we do this, uh, whack that on there. Then whack this on here, and then whack this on here. There we go. That's quite a nice shape for the front end, so we'll keep it as is. We're then going to go ahead and get the gray again, and we're going to do this. And a lot of the inside is actually going to be gray anyway. So let's do that, that, and this. In fact, for the floor, uh, let's go ahead and do it a slightly lighter gray like we did before. And that's going to cover this bit right here. It'll make it look ten times better. And I think it has. Okay, what's next? Uh, probably the roof. Probably the roof. Okay, so grab these guys. Uh, let's go ahead and do this. So we're going to go with twos. There we go. Uh, and then maybe even fours on the top of that if we can. So one, two, three, four. Ah, oh, we can't do fours. It has to be twos again. Uh, otherwise it won't work. And that doesn't look right. That does not look right. No. Okay, get rid of these. Go ahead and do ones. Okay, this is strange. Do ones, and then do twos, and then do twos again, and that might look better. Or just do this. Hey, there we go. Yeah, and then seal it in across the top, just like so. And I think that's probably fine, I guess. I guess, maybe. There we go. Okay, a little bit strange. It does look a little bit strange. But I think it will work. Maybe. Although, actually, it's nowhere near tall enough, is it? It's not. All right, so I pushed them around a little bit. And uh, clearly, as you guys can see, this is way, way, way shorter than that is. So we need to design this to look nicer so that it matches that a little bit better. And then once we've done that, it should be pretty good to go. All right, so with that being said, let's go ahead and grab the entire thing and move it upwards. So grab this from here, all the way to here, all the way to the top, all the way across the top. And all the way to the other side. Cut it. Move it upwards. One, two, three, maybe even four. Uh, maybe three? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, but what we can do is spawn it back in. One, two, three. Move it as far back as we possibly can in order to actually see if this works. And say yes. Ah. Uh, that is what I would say a bit of an issue. <laughs> that, that's what I would call a bit of an issue. 
Uh, right, okay, because they don't quite fit in together. That's fine. Okay, so we can just push this slightly for forwards. Da -da 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 -da. Uh, not very far. It doesn't have to go far at all, but we just need it to fit in with the other thing. That's all. All right, here we go. Da -da 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 -da. And no, that's not what I wanted. Ah, oh, yikes. <laughs> Big yikes. Okay, spawn this in. And move it backwards. Oh, I need to I need to merge it together. Okay, merge this with this. Go. Spawn it in. Move it backwards. Come on. Go, 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 go. Whoosh. Yeah, okay. So the wheels seem very small for something that's going to be that big, but whatever. Create a vehicle, spawn in our big one. There we go. Yeah, this tender doesn't seem right. It doesn't, but we might be able to make it look right anyway in the end. We'll see. So, push this forwards. Pretty much attach them together, and then we'll see what happens. Alright, so let's get inside of this real quickly and see if it is pretty much level. If it's one down, that is still okay. Um, yeah. Alright, I think we're gonna go with one down. That's that's probably fine. I like it. Yeah, I actually don't mind that. The only thing is, I do feel like we should make it a little bit bigger. Uh, like a little bit longer. Because at the minute, this looks very weird. Uh, also, I'm just gonna go ahead and do this from here up to there. Oh, yeah, that looks bad. <laughs> that looks so bad. Ugh. I don't like it. I don't like it. No. All right, delete all of this. Grab one of these, put it in on its side, just like so, and send it. Okay, yeah, this is horrible. This is actually disgusting. I don't like it. Okay, so when it's spawned in, it doesn't look quite as bad, but it definitely still looks bad. I actually really don't like this so far. Uh, what we'll do is, if we elongate it a little bit more, it might look a little bit better. Because at the minute, it's quite tall, but not very long. So, if we are going to do that, let's go and delete these guys on the bottom. Delete these guys right here as well. And we'll attach another one of these to here, pretty much just like this. So move this all forwards, just like so. Uh, attach that guy onto there like that. Go to the front, do the same thing. Uh, if we can. Do -do 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 -do. There we go. Do the same thing and spawn it in again. Hopefully that works a little bit nicer. Yes. Okay, so. What we'll do is we'll delete this guy and this guy. We'll have these guys come a little bit further forwards, just like so. We'll have these guys come further forwards too. Do this bit, yes, and attach all this together like this. Almost, pretty much. There we go, do that across there. Uh, seal this in across here and across here. And then seal that in as well, I guess. Yeah, sure. Grab this piece, paint all of that. Mm -mm -mm -mm. There we go, and I think that'll be fine. Honestly, I think that will be A-OK. -okay. All right, and then we need to do the same thing or a similar thing on the back. Okay, so I went ahead and extended the back end a lot more, as you guys can see. We're going to go ahead and shove this in here like this, and we're going to go ahead and try and figure out something with this. So one, two, and that'll do. Ladders. Uh, yeah, okay. I want the ladders to actually work, so we're just going to do it like this. And like this. There you go. And then if we paint this piece like so, it should be fine. Let's have a little look at that, see if that is actually true. I think it is. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and attach this to our train, and we'll see what that actually looks like. So let's get ourselves a connector. Uh, I don't know which one to use. Probably go with fluid. Whack that on there. Okay, that looks very simple right now. We will change that in the future. Uh, this also looks very kind of bad. I don't like it. <laughs> I really don't like it. So let's go ahead and save this uh, as our steam locomotive tender one. Okay, save. Okay, good. So a lot of our train will also connect a connector to this as well, and we'll see what that actually looks like. Okay, so currently this is what it looks like. I don't think it looks very good, to be totally honest with you guys. Uh, it needs to be a little bit closer together as well. That is, um, that is a main thing. So we're going to have to either push that bit forwards or this bit backwards. Honestly, this bit is probably going to have to go backwards anyway, so we'll do that. Uh, we then need a connector on the back of this. We also need some bumpers on the back of this. And uh, we probably need some bumpers on the front too. So we'll be able to do all of that and make it look way nicer. But um, yeah, I'm also going to go ahead and try and get the gold line to go around in the same uh, in the same level. Because uh, I think that would be really cool too. So currently it is about there. So if we send that across from, from there. Let's just walk sideways real quick. It's there. So it's one below uh, the two. <laughs> it's one below the two. All right, but... This is it. This is quite cool. 
Uh, I don't know whether the back of the tender needs to look a little bit nicer too. Probably. Because that doesn't look right. And here it is! Okay, so what we're gonna do is uh, bring this to the side. I don't know whether you guys even know what this is, actually. Hang on. Why isn't it... Oh, no. <laughs> That's not what I wanted. Uh, where is it? This is what I wanted. So this is our gold uh, trim bit. We're gonna go ahead and bring this over to the edge. And we're gonna try and line it up. Now, I think uh, the way it lined up was here. So we're gonna go ahead and paste that there. We're gonna move it along. And we're gonna put it in all the way across. And hopefully... By the end, this actually won't look too bad. I don't think it will, actually. So there you go, all the way to the rear. Uh, yeah, all right, seal all this off, connect it all together, there we go. We're then going to go to the front of this one, bring it all the way to the back of this one, copy it, press U, take it over to the other side, paste it in again, merge it together, and spawn it in. All right, now we got a gold stripe. Cool. All right, next thing, next thing. All right, grab this guy, delete this, and move it backwards as I can so that's gonna go around there we're then gonna go and delete these guys we're gonna grab this guy and put it there which is a lot further back but that's okay and there we go nice oh and the other thing we're gonna delete this guy uh, we're gonna go ahead and bring these guys forwards like this and leave that like that I feel like that is um, actually much nicer than it was so we're gonna leave those as they are um, we're gonna go ahead and paint them too Do -do 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 -do. there we go and that's painted on both sides as well. Uh, the other thing, I'm not actually going to have the tender go all the way backwards on the top. We're going to go ahead and delete this, uh, delete that, and delete most of this, and most of this, and most of this. <laughs> there you go. So it's actually going to drop down as it goes backwards, and this will be our top line. Okay, sick. Sick, sick, sick. All right, paint all that in there like that. Go ahead and make this bit red. And that probably looks a lot better, actually. Okay, so uh, the other thing is, I'm actually going to go ahead and paint the top of this like so. Um, we're also going to actually drop the grey bit uh, backwards one, so there is a slight overhang, and I think that's okay. Alright, there we go. Nice, yeah. I think that looks way better than it did, so I'm happy with that. We're also going to delete these guys, grab one of these, in red, I suppose. We're going to then put it on the side like this, and that seems okay too. I'm then going to paint these guys red, all of this red. And actually all of this red. Yeah, it's going to be red in here. Fine. Spawn it in. Let's see what that looks like. I think it looks a lot better than it did. It still looks very weird. I'm not sure about it. Okay, and then if we were to attach it to some other trains, or some cars, or train cars, or whatever, uh, we'd also have to have bumpers. So what we'll do is we'll bring this up to here like this. We'll actually attach that to there as well. Uh, and we'll actually add tank... I don't know. Tank these? Tank these. <laughs> uh, right, okay, yeah, like this. Go ahead and put that there. Attach these medium ones to here. And they might be a bit big, actually. Maybe the small ones? I don't know. Maybe they're a bit small. I don't, I don't actually know. Uh, but they look pretty cool there. Uh, we're then going to do the same thing or a similar thing on the front. So, delete this. Fill this guy in here and here and also there. And then get ourselves the small ones. Whack them on there and save it. Yes! Okay, good. And here it is! So that is our new style. It is a little bit too close together, so we'll modify the bottom bit a little bit more. Uh, but honestly, I think this looks better than it did. So, yeah, I think we'll like the shape. Uh, I don't mind those wheels being like that. We'll change those wheels to look the same, and that will be sick. I might also actually open this bit up at the back too, because uh, I think that'll be a little bit better. So let's go ahead and do this real quick. Uh, and we'll leave that like that. Uh, I don't know whether to have a door on this just yet or not. Probably not just yet, so we'll leave it. Um, but what we need to do is extend this guy a little bit further forwards. So just grab this. Put it there for now, that's fine. Grab a block, put it there. Attach this guy on, delete this. Uh, I might actually extend these guys as well. Because I can. So bring this forwards. Put a tank thingy wheel on there. And save it. Okay. I think that is going to be it for today's video, honestly. So let's go ahead and put it on there. See what it looks like. If it looks good, we'll keep it. And there we go. What do you guys think of this? Uh, I need... I, I, I still think it looks a little bit strange and not amazing. Uh, but I, I think with a little bit of detailing and extra, extra detailing, uh, I think we can make this look really, really cool. Especially if I do something with this golden line. Maybe bring it around here like this. And also we'll have some letters on here as well for maybe Frantic Freight. Or maybe we'll even have the Frantic Freight logo on there as well. That'd be really cool. We can also do a little Frantic Freight logo up there maybe. And also numbers on here as well. 
Uh, and then I think we're pretty much done with it. I, I don't want to make this thing extremely detailed or anything like that. Um, I just want it to work and look quite nice too. Anyway, for now, I'm going to go ahead and say thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.